In this video, I will show you how to stop Google Chrome from blocking downloads. If you do have any questions regarding this tutorial, feel free to drop that down in the comment section down below. And with that being said, let's jump straight into it. So here we are on Google Chrome. So what you want to do is open up a new browser. Then what you want to do is come up to the top right hand corner and click onto the three dots up here. Next, what you need to do from this menu is come down and click onto settings. Then from here, come over to the left hand side to this menu and click onto privacy and security. So what you want to do from here is there's a section called privacy and security. And in here, you want to click onto security. Now the reason the download is probably not happening is because you've got enhanced protection selected or standard protection. So you can see for example for enhanced protection there are faster proactive protection against dangerous websites downloads and extensions warns you about password breaches requires browsing data to be sent to google now to go ahead and stop google chrome from blocking downloads all you need to do is come and select this option which says no protection as you can see it does say not recommended so make sure the file that you are trying to download is completely safe before doing this but if you are sure the file is safe what you can do is temporarily change the option to this you're going to get a pop-up saying turn off safe browsing all you want to do is press the blue turn off button it's going to set to no protection so what you should now be able to do is download that file as I say, make sure the file is completely safe before you do this. Once you've downloaded the file, you can come back here and change back to standard or enhanced protection. So that is how to go ahead and stop Google Chrome from blocking downloads. With that being said, I hope this tutorial did help you out today. And if this did help you out, I would really appreciate it if you was to consider dropping down below the video, leaving a like and also subscribing to the channel. With that being said, I just want to take a minute to thank you guys for watching this tutorial and I will see you in the next video.